to Space to Grow. I'm Shaniqua Vereen, and this week we take a look ahead at the next mission flying to the International Space Station. On Wednesday, January 25th, a pair of news conferences at NASA's Johnson Space Center in Houston highlighted the agency's SpaceX Crew-6 mission to the International Space Station in February. The mission is NASA's sixth crew rotation flight involving a U.S. commercial spacecraft carrying crew for a science expedition aboard the Microgravity Laboratory. The purpose of the space station, it's a national lab and it's for scientific research. So we have this incredible, unique, weightless environment where we can conduct amazing scientific research and that's why we go to the ISS. We will be subject to a lot of uh, scientific uh, observation that is done before the flight, during the flight and post-flight to see the impact of uh, weightlessness on our, on our bodies, on our uh, body mass. So it's all for the sake of science and uh, it's all for the uh, sake of uh, the push towards uh, the boundaries of exploration towards space. The Crew-6 mission will carry NASA astronaut Steve Bowen and Warren Hoberg, as well as United Arab Emirates astronaut Sultan Anayadeh and Roscosmos cosmonaut Andrei Fedyayev. The Falcon 9 rocket and the Dragon Endeavor spacecraft is scheduled to launch no earlier than February 26th from Launch Complex 39A at NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida. During their mission aboard the orbiting laboratory, the Crew-6 astronauts will conduct cutting-edge research. Studies of material flammability, tests of treatments for cardiac disease, and demonstration of a new tool that could monitor changes to the immune system during deep space exploration missions are just some of the more than 200 experiments that will occur during the mission. What we learn from the International Space Station will help us to explore Mars, especially for our transit habitat needed to get to and from the Red Planet. This week on Houston We Have a Podcast, Paul Kessler, aerospace engineer from NASA's Langley Research Center, discusses what a spacecraft that would take future Mars explorers to and from the Red Planet would look like. As always, you can catch the interview on Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, and SoundCloud. That's Space to Ground for this week. Thank you for watching.